Hello guys, I've made the list of the top 5 best palette busters 2022, that are available on the market, I made this list based on my research, if you would like to see additional information and updated prices, be sure to check out the description below and subscribe to get more reviews. Ok, let's get started with the video. Number 5 the Dead Demon from Angel Guard is a brightly colored tool that changes removing nail planks from a chore to an easy task that you can complete in a matter of minutes. This is achieved thanks to the top-notch build quality of this pallet dismantling bar. Right off the bat, by taking this metal beast into your hands, you realize how light it is. Thanks to the welded reinforced joints, the tool is extremely durable without being too heavy at the same time. The subtle yet highly effective aspect of its design allows wielding this deck wrecker with ease to match, which results in a job getting done fast and effective. For your convenience, the handle is equipped with a non-slip grip which makes it comfortable to use even without work gloves. Additionally, the 44-inch long handle, in combination with dual claws, makes it easy to lift wooden planks from decks, pallets, as well as from the roofs. As for the claws themselves, they are fixed in place, meaning that you can use one claw at a time in case you need to leverage smaller pieces of wood. In the end, this deck demon from Angel Guard will be a solid choice for you, provided you are looking for a device that combines reliability and an affordable price at the same time. Number 4 Solid and simple, the Stoic Tools Palette Buster is a great tool for removing boards from just about any situation. Whether you're taking the boards off of a pallet, deck, roof joist, or removing wooden siding, this tool is capable of it all. It seems like a tough build tool at first, with thick, strong welds on the tongs of the fork. If you're ripping apart softwood pallets, this tool will perform admirably. It yanks them apart with relative ease and makes the entire job pretty quick and painless. But if you attempt to pull apart some hardwood pallets with this pallet separator, you might have a different experience. Hardwoods can actually bend the fork of this tool when you apply too much pressure. It might seem tough, but this tool isn't quite as rugged as it appears. At just 13 pounds, this tool is a bit lighter than some of the others, though it's also not quite as durable. It's got a 41.5 inch long handle, which is plenty to provide leverage for the softer woods this tool can pull apart. Unfortunately, the space between the forks is just 2.75 inches. This means you're not getting it over a 4x4 or even two 2x4s that are set against each other. Still, for basic pallet and deck board removal, this tool is perfectly applicable. Number 3 If a clever name was all it took to be a great tool, then there's no question that the Dark Bill Deck Wrecker would be the best tool for the job. Luckily, it's more than just a great name because this tool performs exceptionally well and it is better for the high price this pallet breaker sells for. With two large metal hooks built in to pry out the boards from underneath and an extra long 54 inch handle, this tool provides plenty of leverage to help lift even the most stubborn pallet boards. But it's usable for more than just pallets, this tool can be used to remove decking boards, roof joists, wood siding, and more. The teeth look like they might damage your boards, but they don't. Still, the boards can crack or split during removal even though the rotating head lets you get in close and get a solid hold on each board. Fewer boards will break if you remove some of the nails first, but this pallet breaker doesn't include one. Another drawback is that this tool has a pretty narrow spread of about 3 inches at the forks. This is fine for fifting over the smaller boards used in standard size pallets, but if you want to remove deck boards off a 4x4 or you want to disassemble an oversized pallet, you'll probably need a tool with a wider set of forks. Number 2 The biggest drawback with many types of pallet breaking tools is that the forks aren't wide enough to fit over the larger boards used on oversized pallets. But the Molomax Pallet Buster Deluxe seeks to solve this problem. Its forks are spread 4 inches apart, giving this pallet breaker ample space to fit over a 2x4 to disassemble pallets made with larger wood. In fact, it's the only pallet buster with large enough forks to do so. Another great feature of this pallet dismantler bar is that it comes apart. The handle breaks down into three separate pieces and the foot comes off as well. 
This is great for storage or transportation since the entire tool breaks into pieces and doesn't take up much space. But that also means you have to go through the hassle of reassembling it every time you want to pull apart a pallet. If you were trying to pull apart pallets with a crowbar and hammer, you'd likely ruin most of the boards. But with the Molimax Pallet Buster Deluxe, you can yank the boards off without causing any damage to them. There's even a nail removal tool cut into the back of the Pallet Buster so that you can easily remove any nails without having to reach for a separate tool. Number 1 when it comes to busting apart pallets, leverage is the name of the game. Those pallets are tough, and without proper leverage, it can be an exercise in futility attempting to break them apart. That's why the Vestal Deluxe Steel Pallet Buster has a 45-inch handle, to give you plenty of leverage so you can pop the boards right off the pallet without breaking your back. But taking the pallet apart is only part of the struggle. If you want to use those boards for something else, then you have to ensure they don't get damaged or destroyed during the removal process. To the tend, this pallet breaker has an articulating head. This allows it to gently remove the boards from the pallet without splitting, cracking, or otherwise damaging them. At 12 pounds, this is a pretty stout tool. It's made from solid metal and the handle is very thick to ensure that even when you're applying maximum pressure, the tool will hold up and won't bend or shatter. The gap between the forks is 3.5 inches at the smallest point. This is the perfect size for ripping apart standard pallets, but unfortunately, it's too small to yank apart oversized pallets made with 4 inch wide wood. Still, it's the perfect tool for pulling apart any regular sized pallet and can even be used for yanking off decking boards as well. Thanks for watching guys. I hope this video helped you. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to like comments and subscribe so you don't miss anything. We'll see you next time.